Hello guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to SimUK. Welcome back to uh, the prison. Ooh, hang on, my phone just buzzed. Is that the wife asking me to pick her up? Oh, it is the wife. Yes. Let's see what she wants. She might just be saying, hello. Right, okay, so what are we going to do in this episode? Today we're going to have to... What are we doing today? The canteen! Oh, I haven't done that for a while. Free time, prison stroll, haven't done that for ages. And the workshop, cool. We've got an extra workshop placement now. So hopefully... I'm in the wrong place. Hopefully um, we'll make a bit more money and then we can buy something at the end of the day. Alright, everyone ready? Everyone sit down and get stuck in. I do I do like how they animated this bit. It's really cool. I think they could have done a little bit more with the prisoners and stuff. That just means he doesn't like it. There's nothing wrong with him. Alright, so, me and the team, what's going on? What is going on? Cancelled due to random reasons. What? That is a bit random. What is everyone doing? This is my friend here, Corey. Even he wants to punch me. What is going on? Why is everybody dancing? What is going on? Right, well. Oh, I cannot leave with the routine in progress. Well, what am I meant to do then? Final warning. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Everybody's dancing. Stop dancing. Stop dancing. I had to knock him out. If he gets up and starts dancing again, I don't know what to do. What the hell? Talk to the prisoner who's given out the food. Oh. You've been lacing all their food. What do you want? Complaints only in writing. What did you serve for dinner today? Well, the usual. Some goo, overcooked vegetables, and some meat looking stuff. They haven't changed the recipe, or maybe you served overly strong coffee. Listen, I only serve the food here. If you have a problem with the food, then go to the kitchen and talk to the chef. I think I'll do that, because this is very not normal behavior. Where's the chef? You must be the chef. Hello, Chef. Are you in charge here? Yes, you got a problem? I mean, something other than digestive disorders, because I don't care to hear about those. Did you change any ingredients in today's food? I hardly ever make any changes in my recipes. But who the hell knows what my good-for-nothing helpers are adding to the pots themselves, if you know what I mean. It's hard to keep an eye on them sometimes. I'm going to take a minute of their time, if you don't mind. Fine, but not for too long. They need to clean up this pigsty. Uh, let's talk to these people here. John! Did you help prepare today's meal? No, 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 only clean here. Peel potatoes and vegetables. Okay. You look like you're a bit more involved. Alberto! Yes, I'm talking to you. Did you help prepare the meal? 
Yes, that's what they dragged me in for. What did you do exactly? Well, I mostly threw things in the pot. Wherever the chef told the others to chop or peel. And all prepared spices. Okay, I need to check those out. Now I'm going to talk to Mr. Skyrunner. Is something wrong? Did you help prepare today's meal? No, I only wash the dishes here. I don't touch the food except for the leftovers in the trash bag, which I throw out. Okay. Search the kitchen thoroughly. What's this? Leaves. Ah, oh, I've got to talk to the cook again. Okay. Yes. Ah, oh, that's the cook. Albert. What are these? Well, bay leaves, I think. They don't smell like it. Maybe the chef ordered cheap ones. <coughs> Excuse me, why did you add so many of them to the pot? Well, a whole bag of them was right next to the other ingredients, so I thought I was supposed to add the whole thing. You realise we cook for a really large group of people here, right? I'm confiscating these leaves. You confiscate bay leaves? Why? I need to check them out. Just a few leaves so the chef won't be mad, I think. Anyway, I had nothing to do with this. Right, back to the back to the proper chef, the head chef. You again, yes, tell me, where did you get these leaves? What leaves? The bay leaves! Ah, what next? Maybe I need to order some saffron too. We don't use any fancy spices like that. Only salt and pepper, and not all the time either. Herbs are wasted on this bunch. Then why did we find them in your kitchen? I don't know, they're not mine, for sure. I told you my help was difficult to supervise, and sometimes add something to the pot themselves. But why bay leaves? I have no idea. We'll talk later. So that was interesting. <laughs> and this... Some noises. Hello? Does anybody copy? You will die in seven days. What? And you will die in one if you don't stop these phone calls. Hello? Who's there? Stop with your jokes, I said. Is that you, newbie? What are you talking about? You called me first for that stupid joke. I, 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 I did not call you. Or maybe I butt-dialed you, if so, sorry about that. Over and out. Now I'm going to talk to Jim Lee. I know exactly who Jim Lee is. He's over here with his shirt off, look. These guys are all out of control. Jim, I need to talk to you. I have a favour to ask. Ask out a favour to ask of an inmate? Well, this will be interesting. Well, I'm listening. I know that you're here because you used to sell drugs. Go on. Can you tell me what these leaves are? Bring them here. Damn, this is cocoa. Cocoa leaves. How did you get them? Did you confiscate them from someone? Cocoa, you say? That's all I need to know. Thanks. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Wait, I didn't think to, you know, to sell them. You can't get high with plain leaves, but they work better than any coffee. I can pay you well, I think. $75 sounds good. Ah. Uh, uh, I can't sell them. Well, shame on you. I can pay that much for them now, but I can't guarantee that price later on. Okay, buddy. Now I'm going to talk to Albert O'Neill. I don't know who Albert O'Neill is. So, we're going to have to inspect everybody. Albert O'Neill. Oh, come on. Borrow him. Oh, hang on. Albert O'Neill, that's you. I remember. I'll put it to you straight. Tell me the truth or you'll spend the rest of the month in solitary on bread and water. After you get back from the hospital. Okay, okay, fine, I'll tell you. I bought those leaves. I knew they were cocoa leaves. I put them in the main pot just for fun. I wanted to see how people would react after dinner. Who did you get them from? From Mario Griffin. But I have no idea where he got them. I swear. If you're trying to frame my colleague, I'm telling the truth. I swear, I swear on my grandma's grave. Okay, let's say I believe you. So maybe Mario Griffin has something to do with those packages in the morgue. What was that? I couldn't hear you. Nothing. You're free to go. And tell no one about the cocoa leaves or about our little talk. Oh, things are hotting up. Go talk to Jim Lee again. Maybe he wants to buy them this time. Hey, Jim. What's the matter? I need you to get something for me. 
Now you have my attention. Are you able to get me a video camera? The unavailable That's spying sort? You want to peep on someone, you perv? Wink, wink. None well, of your business. Okay, but tell me, why don't you just get it yourself? You know, go to a shop, just buy the stuff. That would be cheaper. I can't take that kind of stuff into the prison. The officers check each other too, you know? And you always find a, a way to smuggle stuff in. I guess in high, I can't Fair me. enough. I can get you a camera, but you need to wait a few days. I only hope you got enough money for it. How much? Three hundred dollars! It's cheap anyway, and you can pay on delivery. I have no other choice. It's a deal then. I'll let you know when the order is ready. Ah, man, I've got to get three hundred dollars together on a camera. Holy moly smokes. Right, well, let's go let's go lift some weights. Because what we're gonna need to do now is make some money. How much money have we got? 180. That's not going to do it. Oh, no! No option. Oh, no. How am I going to make money? Not darts. I am rubbish with darts. Oh, hang on. Is that my friend? Is that my friend coming back? Yes! Good timing. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I need to play. Let's play. Let's play. Let's play. Let's play. Let's play. 50 bucks. Let's do it. This is by far the easiest way to win money, I think. Unless you can Shanghai somebody, but that's not that easy. I've done it once and I've lost it twice. Halfway with 30 seconds to go. Five to go. Last one. Ooh. Okay, there's a bit of cash. All right, looks like we're uh, we're on this duty today. Cool. Oh, uh, I wonder if I could sell some stuff. What did you say? What do you mean everybody dies? Maybe I'll work out in the gym. If those beefcakes free up some space. Hmm. I'm feeling a little bit intimidated. <laughs> they all seem to be taking a lot of interest in me. Even Nicholas. Stop it, Charles. Enough. We're gonna get punished. No phones. Your call privilege is taken away. So yeah, I'm thinking of selling some stuff. Uh, who should I sell some stuff to? A few people over here. Oh, son of a bitch. Now, they normally do that to distract you so that they can do something else that they shouldn't be doing. All right. So there's three, four, okay. Gonna pass on the can to tuna. Too many people looking at me. Let me find a bit of a quiet spot. What about over here? Hey, hands. <laughs> no, you didn't do nothing. Let's trade. I'm selling. I've got a file. I've got some cigarettes. I can sell you all of those. So you got twenty dollars left. Okay, well that's it. Then. 
So I'm still waiting for Jim Lee to get the camera. I'll let everybody stay out here a little bit longer than usual. That way they can... Uh, maybe go up to... Look at that. 49.4% happiness or respect from the prisoners right now. So uh, if I can get that up to 50%, we'll actually be making more money. More money, more money. Oh, we could do another bet. But hang on, what did he say there? Was there a different game? Uh, that's right. Awesome. So maybe we'll up the stakes just for the adrenaline. I'm in. Okay, well, let's see if you can do 25 curls in 90 seconds. Show me the money. 70 bucks. Okay. Okay, I've got to do 25 now. Is that going to be harder? I think it is. I was only just doing 15 or whatever it was. Okay, so the, the break's over. I'm now in free time, so this is uh, working out quite well. So the prisoner's got an extra long break. What's weird is, though, that they still don't have to go in even after the time has run out. Oh, yeah, we're good. We're good. It's tight, but we can do this. Oh. Missed a couple. Oh, it's getting close now. A lot of money on the line. Oh, no. I think I'm going to do it. Whoa. Just. Woof. All right, so now we've got $446 in the bank. Things are looking a lot better. We've got the money we need for Jim Lee's camera. We've just got to give him a couple of days to get the camera sorted out. And then we can, uh, then we can rock and roll. I'm very interested to find out what we find out. All right, what are we doing now? Prisoner guards, 91.9%. That's dropped by 9%. Why has that dropped so much? What's happened? What have I done? All right, so I can pick six prisoners for the workshop. That Bruce. That's Corey. I have Gene. Oh, where is he? Where is he? Where's, where's my main man? Jim? I need you, mate. Brian? And William? Alright, gentlemen. Follow me, please. Quick as you can. We're in a rush. Come on, boys. No hanging about. Let's get going. Oh, nice. We've got an extra... Oh, I can't do it till they're here. Finally. Goodness me. Right. So we should make extra money today. Yeah, 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 whatever. Go work, earn me money. Alright, let's make sure everybody's working today, gentlemen. No messing about, alright? Oh, come on. him. Good, everybody's working. What the hell? What the flipping... What happened to Jim Lee? It's like he got his hand caught in the lathe or something. I can't believe that. The 
first day we have an extra pair of hands to come and help out and make a bit of extra money and he chops his bloody arm off what an idiot hey what i'm not actually punching him am i ah great they're all kicking off hey 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 get over there and do some work Corey. i don't care if you're on my man or what but not my man that's not what i meant are you actually doing anything Your ass is itchy. <laughs> You're not working, Gene. Uh, yeah. yeah, I don't like that. Yeah. No. Thank you for the backup, officer. You're not working. What is going on here? All of you, stop working. Son of a bitch. What is going on here today? I can't tell if he's working or not. I think he is. I think he's working. Ah. <sighs> So we've only earned $53 today. That is absolutely atrocious. Oh, nice. Cigarettes, we'll take those. Thanks very much. What was that? Oh, I saw some documents or something. Right, well... Okay, $65 is not big amounts of money, but it's enough. All right, rally up. Useless, a lot of them today. Absolutely bloody awful. Give me back the tools. I'll be ready for a shakedown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me the tools. Don't need all the chat. Don't need all the chat every single time. This could be just a single click thing. It really could. Right. Good, good, good. So. Pieces of wood. That's illegal. I'm going to take that because I've never seen that before. Uh, no way, I'm confiscating it. Yeah, give up. Corey, what you got? Uh, sure. There's a story about a boy who lost an arm in a car accident, but he still wanted to learn judo, so he found a master who agreed to teach him. But this master. Yeah, I've got to go. But I haven't finished yet. Sorry, dude. Yeah. Let me another time. Oh, I can't let you get away with the drill bit. Is he actually paying me anymore? I don't even know if he is. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Well, we've got an agreement. We, yeah. Ah, uh, uh, shut up. Yeah, you can keep them. What have you got? Nothing. What have you got? A hammer? Taking that oh, again. Okay. okay, follow me, gentlemen. Time to go. Oof. We're in a bit of a rush. Wiffy Wifey wants me to pick her up. So we got to, got to get a bit of a jog on now for this one. Come on, everybody. Clap your hands. I'm gonna sing a song and it goes like this. So morale went down a little bit. But it's still prisoners, over 50% for the first time ever. And that means no money for us. 
Is that the end of the day? It is. The, t the canteen thing was terminated. So I've got to wait for that camera. So that's pretty good. Okay, we are making progress for sure. Where is the officer? Where is, um, what's his name? Oh, that was clever. I opened the door before I opened the uh, gate. I didn't even know you could do that. Right, so down here is... No, that's the visiting room. Down here somewhere. Search room. Canteen of Confused. Where is this? Gone too far. <gasps> Gone too far! TV room. Showers. Infirmary. There we are. Warden's office. That's what I was looking for. All along. Right. What can we uh, get for the prisoners? Uh, we got some dumbbells. We could get some barbells. Get some chairs, some cabinets, some crates. Standard quality bars. They look ordinary and are very much so. Okay. Uh, bed frames. Sinks. Toilets. Uh... So I could upgrade them for five hundred dollars. And now it costs nine dollars per prisoner. How is that better? That looks exactly the same. What I should have done is upgrade the cameras, but that's two grand. Right, barbells, five hundred. Oh damn it, I haven't got enough. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, Janet. Okay, what about weapons? Gun, nightstick, pepper spray, taser. How much is that? 400. Oh, but I need 300 for the camera. I need 300 for the camera. Damn it. Still not porn. Okay, good enough. Good to know. Good it didn't, it didn't exactly work out how I planned, to be honest. I'm rushing a bit too much. All right, let's get this day over and done with. Apologies for the rushy nature of this one. I have to go pick up the wife. Yes, we're done for today. So we still got $673 for the uh, place, for the prison. Uh, guard respect has gone down to 96%, which is still pretty good. Riot risk is down to 16, which is incredible. Prisoner respect is up to 51. So I've hit the 50 that I was after. All very good stuff. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.